And that means high school football, but at Tempe High School tonight, the real highlight was a surprise wedding proposal at halftime involving two school employees. My name is Dennis and Dawson, one of the campus of Tempe High. We're getting ready for a special event, event September 5th here. I'm going to propose to my girlfriend. It's going to be an amazing experience. That's Tiffany Bunnell. She's a teacher at Tempe High, and she has no idea that the band is performing in her honor. And she's about to get a proposal from her boyfriend. Here it comes. experience a lot of things have happened that she doesn't even know uh, God has been doing on this end to back up a little bit uh, this summer when we were dating she showed me a video that meant a lot to her it was a guy proposing to his girlfriend and it was done so creatively there was like 64 people that were involved in it uh, he puts her on the back of an SUV he blocks off the street he's driving down the street real slow very theatrical performance where basically all these people are involved where they come in at different times and interact uh, the song is Bruno Mars Marry Me. Uh, when she showed me the video, I was blown away. This video meant a lot to her because it helped her during a time of depression and things that she was going through. And so I was thinking like, I knew where we were headed as far as the proposal. How could I incorporate this video into the proposal? So I thought, this was over the summer, so I thought once school gets back in, maybe I can get with the drama department, uh, show them the video, the teacher, see if she can maybe do something on a smaller scale because it was such a huge theater. Uh, the, uh, choreographed performance so I thought maybe on a smaller scale they could do something uh, so then as I got to do that uh, thinking about that I came to school over the summer I talked with my principal uh, Shelly Arredondo and also Stacia Wilson and uh, Stacia Wilson has been key uh, as far as this whole thing has gone she's the one who had the vision of Tiffany and I walking down side by side in the hallway together and she thought hmm that might be a great looking couple she's the one who approached me uh, she, uh, last year at the end of the school year and she's like what, what how do you think about Tiffany, you know? And I was like, what do you mean? Because I thought at the time we were just friends. I didn't really think much of it. She's like, well, you're an attractive male and she's an attractive female. So what do you think? And she said at the time, my look on my face was I was really not really understanding where she was coming from because it wasn't the right time. But after that conversation, it was like a veil was removed from my eyes. I immediately saw that, okay, there's something definitely here. And coincidence enough, she was out in the parking lot. Tiffany, when I walked out, was out there. To this day, Tiffany tells me, I was looking at her very differently that day. Something happened, and it was all in God's timing. So moving forward to this, uh, this proposal, I had an idea that the Spirit put on my heart as far as including the video. 
where it went from there, I was really blown away because as I told uh, Stacia and also Shelly, they're like, okay, hang on a second, let's brainstorm, let's get together. So they went home, uh, Stacia talked to her husband, Rod, uh, Shelly talked to her daughter, uh, Kaylee Arredondo. Uh, the next day I happened to be here in the summer working again out of my office. They both came in, Shelly was like, you'll never guess what. I said, what? She said, I showed it to Kaylee. Kaylee said, why doesn't he, does he do it during a halftime show of a football game? I was blown away. I never thought about anything on that scale. She's like, yeah, you could get the band involved and you know, maybe the, the dance the team can do something. So I went and talked to the band teacher, Mike, and I showed him the video. And he went to some website uh, where they download musical notes and stuff. And he's like, you know what? We can do this. This is real easy. I can teach the band this. So the band was working on the song from Bruno Mars. I went and showed Amber, the dance teacher here, the video. And uh, she, I said, I gave her free reign because the choreography was, it was a lot in the video. I'm like, you don't have to do exactly what they're doing, but just do something similar, you know, or just have some type of choreography with the song. So she's like, okay, I got it. So the dance team's doing it. The band's team, the band's working on the music. The whole time, none of the kids know that they're involved in a proposal. They just think they're doing a halftime show or performance. So um, I've been meeting with Amber and also Mike uh, periodically. Uh, Amber just recently told me that the idea she came up with was doing a flash mob. She's gonna have all her dance team in the stands. They're gonna, uh, when the music starts to play, they're in a flash mob, jump up from the stands, run out on the field and do their choreography. Meanwhile, uh, as the band, I'm gonna basically show up in uniform like I am now uh, before the game so she doesn't know any different. I'm gonna dress out before halftime. Now the band, in the video, uh, the choreography uh, separates, they form a column and then he walks down the column to propose to his girlfriend. So what the band's gonna do is on the 50 yard line, they're gonna separate and form a column and then I'm gonna walk down. Now I won't be by myself because she has a daughter, Aubrey, five year old Aubrey, beautiful uh, daughter and I want her to be part of this uh, special time and, and moment. When uh, Tiffany and I first started dating, Aubrey was a little bit fearful uh, that I was taking mommy away and, and now she's come to see that I'm just another person to love her. So I want her to be part of this engagement. So when the band uh, splits, it'll be Aubrey and I walking down. I'll be holding Aubrey. Aubrey will have a microphone because I'll be mic'd up so the, cr the crowd can hear me. And Aubrey will also have the ring that I'm gonna present to Tiffany. So as we walk down together, oh, I'm gonna also have a, a dozen of her favorite flowers, uh, sunflowers I got, I got for her too. So as we're walking down the 50 yard line together, we'll be approaching Tiffany who'll be on the sidelines with her cheerleaders because she coaches cheer. So at this point, I'm gonna get the mic from Aubrey. I'm gonna say what I say to uh, Tiffany to tell her how much she means to me. And then I'll get the ring from Aubrey and present the ring to Tiffany. This way, Aubrey's kind of involved in the in engagement as well. And it's just the new union and joining of us, of us all three as family. Uh, she has no idea what's going on. She has, uh, I talked to her Sunday. She's like, I don't know what you have planned. She has no idea that this is taking place September 5th, which is our first home game against Coconino. So all this, it's been an amazing experience. Uh, I can't even take credit for this. God has been doing everything. Uh, people involved, uh, they love her here. She's been here 10 years. I've been here three years. There's so many people that just want to get involved and this thing has taken off and has become bigger than I've ever imagined, which shows me how powerful God is and how, how much his hand has moved because this, is the, this thing is nothing I've ever planned. So this, this will be a, another surprise too is her parents are coming in town. I got a hold of her mom and dad. She has no idea, they're flying in Friday. They'll be here around 10 o'clock. So I'm gonna meet with them uh, Friday and have lunch and stuff like that. So she has no idea, family's gonna be here. I got a hold of her friends from college. Some of her really close friends are coming into town. All of them will be seated on the visitor side. Um, I'm gonna make sure that they're all uh, snuck in over to the visitor side. So she's not aware if she happens to scan the crowd, she won't see family or friends. So she'll have two surprises, the engagement, the song, the video, all that stuff that she loved and held dearly will be part of the engagement and then also that her family's in town so she'll have that surprise afterwards it's all done so it's just going to be a, celebra a celebratory moment I'm very excited a little nervous but more excited because this whole process has been such a relaxing process it hasn't been stressful it hasn't been forced it was totally like the hand of God was involved it's just been amazing to see and I can't wait to share so many of the so many of the details that have happened with Tiffany because she's this is for her so she has not even known and seeing all these blessings and doors that have been opened and seeing how much God loves her and how God loves her through the people that are in her life. So it's just gonna be an amazing time.